Auditions are the hardest thing I do each year. They have to be able to read music. They have to be able to read rhythms. I'm sorry. Oops. It used to be I just wanted a good sounding choir, but I felt like all I was really giving these kids was the ability to stand in a, a semicircle and sing five or six or seven ditties, and that's it. I can't tell you what it says to me when you are not prepared and then you sit in your audition and cry. He's a little intimidating. He seemed very serious. How much did you prepare for this audition? I did prepare, but I'm nervous. It's true that he's never satisfied. I want you all to sing the same ooh vowel there, fix it. If you've reached this bar, then I'm gonna move the bar here. F folks, these are tiny details, but it's what's gonna separate choirs. I think that's part of the journey and part of what makes learning incredible. Always reaching for what can come next, what can we do next, how can we push kids more? Without killing them, of course. But yeah, I had no idea what I was getting myself into when I joined. I'm a tough cookie. <laughs> I don't believe people can make really good music together unless they love and trust the people that they're making music with. The senior boys, I don't understand what's going on in their brains. Choir girls, if you anger them, they will draw claws. They're like, ah! What do you want from this year? When we're together, it's just, it's like nothing else. Everyone cares about the music and cares about each other and working together, and that sensation is like ecstasy. I love choir. It's just been one of the better high school experiences. Choir has done a lot for me. He put so much into this program and this choir, and he just wants it to succeed so much. I want what we're doing to feel so great and so right that I get goosebumps every day, and that you do too.